Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to another late night here on the East Coast. How y'all doing? Hopefully pretty good. So we're going to start with a really short one Fox sent us recently. And after that, we're going to jump into... I, I can't imagine it's overly long, but I don't think we'll finish it tonight. Um, but a horror first-person shooter game. Um, a lot of people might be like, FPS games, yeah, there's a lot of first-person games that are horror. No! I mean, that's, that's true. Um, oh. Game Fox sent might have crashed. There are a, uh, well, no, it's not supposed to be Black Box. Game crashed a little bit. We'll give it one more shot. If it doesn't work, that's okay. We'll just hop right into, uh, main event. I'm gonna get ready to time stream. Yeah, you can't. Oh, okay. It opened twice. So that's extra spooky. Nice. I'm trying to sound like an OG PlayStation. Oh yeah. Oh that that sounds like hot farts. Oh baby. Oh you you love to see that. Uh, I assume the screen is not supposed to be pitch black while the game's running. Uh, I mean, technically it wasn't pitch black. It was, uh... It's crackly. I mean, I... <laughs> I would make the assumptions to some jank. I, I would, yeah. I'm gonna say it's broken. Making an executive decision here. They should not. Yeah, it's it's definitely busted. That's cool. All right. Well, next game it is. That's why you have two planned horror games because you never know. So, yeah, we'll try it another time. It's not the first game we've had not work. Um, sometimes I just have to like wait. A little while um and then like an update comes out and then the game starts working login just broke i haven't missed anything all this we're just chatting that's the thing so a lot of people be like oh there's a ton of horror fps games uh but they mean first person horror games which there are there are a lot of them there are very few horror fps s is in shooter games um now, some of our all-time favorites, of course, are first-person shooters. Realms of the Haunting. Um, uh, Clive Barker's Undying. It's just absolutely incredible. Uh, this, however, looks pretty weird. So we'll see. I don't know if this is any good. But I've never played it, and I have it sitting around. So, horror? Shooting? Hmm. Yeah, it, it looks interesting. I'm a big fan of Geiger, as people may know. H.R. Um, Giggler, as some say. Um, really like his, his art style. This kind of looks like it's playing into that, right? Very biomechanical. And it has menus, which most of these games have not had. So that's kind of nice. Human resources Giggler. Yeah, that's right, yeah. We'll see. New game, please. You charge GG more. I mean, it's already pretty cool. It was born at the dawn of consciousness. Oh no. Oh no. Billy. It evolved and grew in a perfect symmetry with humankind. It is still growing, like a parasite. Starks. 
heads of Hydra don't rise again. They have always been reason. Proud and hateful, their hypnotizing and mesmerizing eyes breed upon fear and sins of individuals, societies, nations, generations, and civilizations. Sages of old times called them four evil princes of this world, but slave priests worshipped them as messiahs, saviors of human souls, as the way, the truth, and the life. Many times they changed their form to deceive, bewitch, and to evolve in response to any defense of inhabitants oh. of this planet. Ooh, that's spicy. Where does high You won't find it in the ashes of Golgotha, neither in the streets of cursed city of Corazon, nor in the catacombs buried under the rock of Saint Peter. Who didst create it but human hands and thoughts and words and deeds? I mean, that was a spicy take. It's deep inside each one of us. For the dark is one, but its shapes are many. We are its makers, but we lost control over it. It enslaves us and takes pleasure of our pain, suffering, and pity hopes of bright afterlife. The journey you must take will lead you to the deepest labyrinths of your true self, to the heart of the shadow. You must confront it to break the inner chains. I mean, cutscenes are a bit loud, right? I think we can agree, but we'll turn it down. We better not be a zombie. Yeah, it's weird uh, they went for like the Catholicism thing. Um, you know, the Noah's Ark, we had, like, obviously the Virgin Mary, like, like very heavy imagery. Um, so I suppose the implication is, like, this is, like, a repeating series of events that these advanced beings, um, are, are sort of putting into our history. Not sure. Seems kind of neat. Um... The voice acting is my god. Um, you know. It, it grew on me a little more, but right in the beginning, it was rough. I feel like it's gonna, gonna look like some art. How's this our audio? Does this look okay? Could be or anything. Oh, okay, motion blur, you gotta go. Get out of here, son of- oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, I guess we're stuck with motion. Ugh. Just the worst thing to have in a shooter. Alright. Like it like it feels like my, my movement's delayed because of the blue. I think it's cool. I assume my character can't read this alien language. What is B? It's E. If you want to push button, push B or E. Okay. Was that a checkpoint then? Okay. It's kind of neat. Starting the Acropolis would change brand in our wrist. Hey, <laughs> yeah, I mean this. Uh, this could be another Bioshock. Who knows? Uh, I would assume not. These are fun though. I like them. Some guy ran up. Okay, not great. Huh. I'm happy the no uh, no nudity. I would say it's a hard thing. 
just jumping into any old horror game because you're not sure how graphic the violence is going to get or uh, how sexual the themes are going to get. Uh, they, it, these are just things that you, you know commonly recur. Um, I mean, H.R. Geiger's work is extremely sexual, but, you know, nobody really likes um, going there, so. Mm. I assume this is what, what we'd look like. Does he have the wrist thing, too? Yeah, okay, so we probably look like one of these guys. I'm guessing, like, the wrist is our health, and that's how you check it. Um, now, there are a lot of shooters that have horror themes, um, like, uh, you know, uh, Pain, what's that, the Pain, Painkiller? Like, stuff like that, right, where it's like, oh, you're, like, you're shooting demons or whatever. And, like, that's super cool, and, like, yeah, like, that's definitely a thing. Um, but, but very few shooters, um much less well do a horror a game you know what I mean okay right so that's bad so I assume we're on a pilgrimage um, our world is this our world even could be uh, like an alien planet like maybe uh, the arc that we got on transported us here um, but we've come to this world anyhow, and we're on a, a presumably like a pilgrimage. Like, we don't really understand. There's like this progenitor race, or maybe like the makers, or like a kind of thing. And we're we're going on a journey of sort of self and, and universal discovery. I guess we can turn the audio up, because it's like super quiet again. Uh, we'll probably go deaf in a cutscene, but... Oh yeah, that got a little spicy. Um, and of course the unworthy just die. Okay. Hello, friend. So are you also human? Okay. I notice nobody speaks. Now we're hoping the game isn't just art. Oh, that's kind of weird. So that's how you get health. Oh, they got fucking arm cannons. Nice. Dante's Infernal. Yeah. No, you, you can't inspect the, uh... Like, here, here's me inter interacting with something. It, like, it, it's not... It doesn't actually let you... Inspect. May I see Jay. Uh, Jay does nothing. DJ dead boy, <laughs> yeah. Jay uh, does not do anything. The controls. Can we put it back on keyboard? Oh, here we go. J for journal. Okay. Yeah, we don't we don't have a journal yet. I wonder if we're supposed to be able to understand any of this. I would assume not. Fuck off. Oh, is there a human's face on that tree? No, never mind. That'd be cool. Hello? <laughs> You'd think that would piss him off. Subtitles. Oh, yeah, good shit. No. So, I think it's intentional that we're left in the dark. To make this world seem alien. Uh, that looks bad, right? 
there. Let's not go that way. It is a silly place. Whoa, yes, please. Can I also have gun? Oh, I was riding on one of their heads. I think I will wait for one of them to come over here. Get nuked. Sorry for cutting ahead of the line, boys. I wonder if we can just slide down there. Probably not. Probably kills you. Yeah, this really does remind me of like the Strog, yeah. Very unreal. Kind of like the shattered worlds up there. Like, that's fun. Nice. Burn them down, boy. Because, like, this looks like I can climb up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. A little secret, perhaps? Do not. Be stuck in something. No, the game's not. Not crazy about my hardcore parkour. Oh yeah, that looks ugly, but a secret. Okay. What is K? He's not even a button. What the fuck? Uh. What? Why does it sound like I'm shooting gun? All right. I can dig it. We're uh. Chronicles of Riddick now. Raise the sun. Raise it. Oh, it won't let me punch this guy. Okay. Uh, is this a positive effect? Yes. Get me in there. Oh, that let me look through that tree. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so I could have potentially done that maybe instead of coming up the path. Or maybe it's just showing me. Go back. That's interesting. No, sadly we can't move it at all. This guy looks... I don't know if he's active or hurt or what. Oh. Oh, okay. So those are like waypoints, or this guy's having a bad day. Okay, we want down there. This looks like some bullshit. I wonder if we we can jump down here. Without taking any. No. Just pat everything in your path. Yeah. FPS horror game set in a surreal, dark, and deadly biomechanical world never seen before. Yeah. Um, I don't know. You know, those are some buzzwords for sure. Okay, we're going to have to... Well, we can crouch. I don't know if the... Plants don't see us if we crouch. They probably... I mean, I imagine they do, right? I would assume you just don't walk in their shit. Okay. T 
content to stealth. I don't even know if this feels like I'm playing the game properly. But I guess it works, so. All hail. Oh, I was hoping that was gun. Um. This guy's kind of cool. Maybe I could have, um. Like, just ate some damage and ran through that. Oh my god, I took damage from that. I took like half my fucking health, stubbing my toe. Excuse me, gents. Yeah, give me that. Okay, so we... Don't run down this, this is dangerous. You might fucking Bethesda yourself to death. I mean, that doesn't look good, right? Alright, what does this say? Oh, he killed it. Oh, yeah, so it's definitely bad. Um. Yeah. Got nothing. I assume that's like acid or something. Or maybe. Okay. It's just a half life thing. I can't I can't read this, but anyway, so she she comes down and she's like talking to the people. Maybe if I use my journal here that does something? No. A little yoga, get it? I'm feeling it. It's over here. I'm afraid to like jump. I'm afraid the platforming will just straight up kill me. Oh, I think they got somebody. No, sir. Yeah, what's this? Hang on. Please say we just found an armed gun. No. I, I don't know what that was. Come on! Uh, let me try the controller. Let's see if the game's just busted because we have a controller. Okay, this is, I think, what we just picked up. We'll say it does play much smoother on a controller. Sure, we can do that. We found the thunder button. Maybe I have to present it to him to leave. Yeah, I see. Ring bearing gift. What's he doing? There, that should have more cinematic feel for you guys. Nice. I like those little checkpoint guys that come out of the ground. What happened to him? He's Oh, he's got the mark on his back. Do we all have that? I don't remember everyone else having that mark on their back. Maybe that's just what you get when you die. Okay, and then she's like teaching them something. Oh, hey! Okay, teaching us uh, chemistry. That's cool. I know, I guess they do all have it on. Oh, I freaked them out. X. Oh, 
wonder if you find enough of those if they uh, like teach you the alphabet for this world. That'd be kind of cool. <laughs> found this glowing dookie, may I pass? A glowing one! Right this way. Okay, so is she bringing us... Is that a gun? Kind of looks like she's bringing us guns, right? Like, training the military. It might not be guns, it just looks like it. Uh, so we did see a large statue of this fella. Hello. I thought there'd be more shooting. Don't get me wrong, like I'm I'm okay with this. It's interesting. I I always get worried though that a game is trying too much to be style and not enough substance. Cause like this world is really cool, right? Like this is really neat to walk around and look at. But is this going anywhere? <laughs> like, do you know what I mean? Struggling. Getting gassed. Anyone else having this problem? The gas? Anyone else having, having issues with the gas? No? Just me? It's like walking through a movie. Yeah, I mean, there are a lot of games they call walking simulators. I'm just, you know. You, you always gotta worry, right? Do we explain this world? Or is it just pictures that look vaguely interesting, like deep? Okay. So it's just gassy in there. I, that will never be explained. I'll tell you right now. Oh, oh, hang on. Okay. Our character has made noise and burn ourselves and go ah put your hand up to a piece of gas oh you so are our characters like are we less intelligent than the average human You know what I mean? Like, have we devolved to, like, an apoloid state? Thank you. Presumably, I'm not supposed to walk just straight up here. I will, though. Is this the sorting hat? Oh my god! Just punch the side of that man's head. It also feels like... Should there be audio? Maybe we're just not plugged into the John Matrix yet. So, we're worthy because we brought a dude hickey. MacGuffin. Maybe they're like fuel cells. Use the power of that giant furnace or whatever in the background. If I never find out, I'm gonna be made. That <laughs> pretty small lord vessel, yeah. I keep thinking there's supposed to be audio, but... But, like, there is audio. Like, my guy's, like, breathing.
That's true, we did hear a guy talking earlier, yeah. So it could be like... Like this is like almost more surreal. Like the fact that nobody's talking. Like that they all just point in silence. Like I feel like that guy should have like screamed right there, right? Am I crazy? Like, that guy should have screamed when he fell? When I'm falling? This has got to be bugged, right? I don't like this is a bold artistic choice if not No budget for voice actors? Yeah, but they had a guy go bippity boppity boop earlier. Okay, we're in we're in our weird little dream state. Is that figure again? <laughs> oh my god. That got me. I didn't expect him to just random vomit burp. Well, that guy died somehow. Like, I think he accidentally got knocked over, but I just don't know how he got impaled. That is weird borrowed. I want spear. So, so... Potentially there should be audio? Oh my god. I mean, th there's audio here. Maybe there's just no talking? Except we heard talking before. Well, to be fair, they're like they're biomechanical Zelfus, so. You know, it's like punching the back of a Terminator. Well, that's not great. Hello. Haha. <laughs> Oh, we're just pissing them off. Turn the music down and others to the max? Yeah, we can do that. You guys hear me punch? We can try reloading the game. Uh, or did it save? Probably right when we fell down, eh? I feel like there should be more audio, though. Somehow. Like, I, I don't know, I could be crazy. But it's kind of funny, like that guy who's, whose head was like the switch, and you're like, just like sort of fucking uh, pop on his head. And he's like, oh, la, la, la. hundred percent strong bullshit. I agree, hundred percent agree. This is very uh, Unreal inspired. Uh. Oh my god, we're already on chapter 2. Continue your journey to discover dark secrets of the ruling caste and their true intentions. I don't feel like I've done any of that. Oh. 
Let's see. I feel like there should be audio when I push the guy's head too, right? Right here. Nope. Oh. Like that's it, eh? Okay. Okay, well we never had this guy scream before. That I remember. Or maybe it's because we had the audio, like the music too high? Well, who knows? How's the health? Bad. We're pretty much dead. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Fuck off. So the, the playthrough that did have some audio... Did the guy speak in English borrowed? Because I kind of imagine this game like all the audio being like, bop, boop, bop, you don't boom. And you're like, uh huh, hmm, yes. Because like none of the, the text is like in English, right? Ah, I understand that. Zombie bad. Go for the stealth kill. Eat shit! Oh god, thanks, tree. Punch him while he's down. You're made of farts, I see. Okay, good. Okay, so there's no English, so I don't feel bad about missing it. There's health here. Let's see if we can sneak up on this guy. Okay, well now we're in the interesting part of the game. Surprise! His spine bleeds, that means he can die. Man, I should install painkiller. That'd be a that'd be a fun little ride. It's not quite undying, but it's good. Oh my god, why do I have to jump to get up? Oh, Zambi. Can they hear me? He sees me, right? Fuck. Doesn't look like I have a, a block button, so we do just punch them till they die. Oh, it looks like... Okay, so I only drain what I need, which is nice. Oh, I can get around here. Oh, this is just loops back to the beginning. N. I'm kind of guessing, like, if we find out all that stuff, maybe we we learn the um, alphabet or something. Oh, it'd be cool if I could punch him into the plant. Oh, it looks like headshots. Um, might stagger more. I'm not sure. This machine's cool. I like I like the healing. Don't say that, bro. There's no way this game's that short. Like, I can't believe there's just nothing to this game. Cool. An Imperial Decree. Oh my god. Actual stuff. This fat bastard. Uh, step in... Uh, thing here. Oh, I see. Uh-huh. Stabby bit. And cut you. Poison and fire seems to get rid of it. Those are bad. We already learned about this stuff, though, in the 
you know, air quotes tutorial, the walking simulator. <laughs> I mean, this this is a pretty cool design, actually. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, if I put this gun on. Okay, use his energy and my blood or something. Or it, it attaches and, and then I'm fucked. A lot of cool stuff going on here. Yeah. Fucking dogs. They also bite you. We've seen this hand before. Stomp on their bones. Got it. Okay. Uh, I can't seem to close the uh, journal. The journal is a damn dirty trap. Oh yeah, no, the, the journals broke the game. Oh no, never mind. Uh, none of those buttons worked, it was a different button. Yeah, I, I assume it's a stealth thing, bro, now. Okay, we can't go that way. Can't go this way either. Ow. Fucker. Alright. Yeah. Over through. You all right, pal? Looks like you're hurting. See, why did it even do like the opening when like? Like, this is teaching us everything? Like, do you know what I mean? Oh. Okay. I don't know, it's kind of weird. This is like a second tutorial. Hey, Wolf, how you doing? Oh, yeah, baby. Gotta go for the sweet headshot, right? Oh, you just stun them and then punch them. Okay, that's that's the combat for this game. Stun and punch. Okay, and then we buried somebody. Um, where's this power cable going? There he is. Can I electrocute him? Nice. Play Poozle. Okay, we need a flamethrower. Did not say electricity. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Did not say electricity worked on these. Um... Let's see it. I get him? Bingo. So you zap him, punch. Nice. Okay. There's our combat. No, 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 not stun punch. Bioshock, zap him and whack him. Yeah, man, Bioshock was actually just super good. It felt really fun to play, too. And it was one of those games that felt like it had a lot of play styles, even though realistically it didn't, but like it it felt like it, man. It's the illusion of truth. Okay, sometimes the zap doesn't zap very long. Sometimes it doesn't zap for jack shit. The audio in this game is really weird. Like, why did it just randomly sound like fire there? Well, I can't, I can't punch this guy because I guess he's in the wall. 
I'm not sure I'm supposed to be killing all these guys. Can we push them off the edge? Wow, goodbye. Alright, let's say you play this game now. And knock him in. Goodbye! We gotta get through that, huh? Secrets? Did I get a new gun? No, oh, I already had a gun. So nothing happened. That's weird. Can you run out of gun? Oh, that's shit, dude. Are you, do you find you're losing more sleep because you work now? Ain't that the truth? There's this really interesting conundrum of work life balance. Uh, if you ever figure it out, let me know. So I wasn't expecting this game to have like branching paths. Like I mean I, I might need to do all this by the end, but So I'm making the assumption this game just has terrible audio mixing. Get him? Our health. That's this. Hmm. So we need. Okay. So we don't really. Is the illusion of choice. Get through there, we presumably have to go open something down the other path. Oh no, there's a little guy right there. Works. Took away your gun license because of all the murders. Oh yeah. Yeah, I, so I have this weird thing, right? My body is so broken for, like, sleep and stuff like that. Um, booga, 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 I stole the baby. Okay, why is the child's heart, oh, wait, no. Never mind, I thought, okay. I thought this here was a baby. Like, just this. So you, you have to picture this the way I see it, because maybe you guys see it correctly. Uh, it's a man standing behind an altar. I saw it. He was sitting up. That's his loincloth. His legs are just like this. Like he's dangling off the altar. That was a baby. And he ripped out a baby's heart. The size of the baby. Like I, I thought he was like doing a like a funky like dance thing. And like, like fucking man spreading on us. But uh, no. T turns out. Oh god my eyes. But, um, yeah, so it doesn't matter when I go to bed. Uh, like, I, I just do not end up getting sleep. Like, yesterday, I wasn't on, uh, because I went to bed early. Which is good. Presumably, right? Nice. <laughs> He's cute. Um... But yeah, so I went to bed like two hours early, so I would have got like 10 hours sleep. Couldn't sleep for like 
you know, two hours. And then Kaylin went to bed, like an hour after I, I fell asleep. I, I woke up, I was up for like two hours, went to bed for an hour, then the cats did some shit. Like, you know, you know what I mean? Like, I just don't... What is hitting me? Oh my god. What a little shitter. Okay, so it's... I guess you can hold this. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I can't fucking sleep. So tonight, I was like, hmm. Almost 11 o'clock. That's my eight hours. Do I get a proper sleep? Or do I come play some, you know, funky, fresh game? At oh, I'm sorry. That didn't work right. Um, because I know I'm not going to get my sleep anyway. Like, why even pretend? Uh, so, guess what I went with? Actually, how's my health? We're like half health. I love the HUD in this game. Oh, we already learned K. But I really like games with minimalistic anything, but especially HUDs. Um, I think it's super cool that I can, like, at a glance, see my health and my ammo. But, like, it doesn't take away from the game. Like, I, I think that's really impressive. Fuck you, pal. What was that? That look kind of weird. We got tons of ammo. I should just be frying everybody. I will say this is definitely not what I expected of the game, um, and I do think it's far from perfect. Let's see if I can just fry somebody. So my gun actually overheats. I don't know if you saw that. It's gonna need. Sorry. What did what did a bell just chime? like random. Also feels like the damage to kill these guys is a bit random. That's where I want to go. D. Okay. But we already learned D. I swear we did. I I certainly wanted a lot more from this game, but at the same time, I came in with no expectations. I got nothing, which I've always said is like one of the benefits. Like I, I stream so many indie games. Um. Or like just small, like nobody games that you haven't heard of. People are like, oh geez, like, you know, how how is it you come across so many great games? And it's like, well, I. It's not so much that the games are like leagues above the competition. It's just when when you go in with like zero expectations, it's really hard to take points away. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> like, there's a lot of them, hey. It was kickstarted for 18k and had a team of seven and a composer. And it took them four years? What the fuck? Okay. Okay. Hear me out. If you told me it took a guy four years to model levels like this and do the art? Yes. Told me it took a guy four years to do the soundtrack? Wow. But, yeah, maybe. Okay. Four years... To, like... I don't know. Four years to code a Unity... I assume it's Unity. Shooter. I'm not sure about that, Tim. Ah! 
Okay, cool. I was afraid I wasn't going to be able to fry it. But I wanted to try jumping in here. Okay, not great. Don't want to go down there, thanks. Very low on ammo. Kind of low on health. Unreal 4. Okay, okay, never mind then. I kind of take it back. I mean, Unreal obviously does a lot of shooters. But I mean, like, it's not like Unity where you can just plug and play a shooter. I wonder if I can just chain them here. And then just get eight. What's our health? Basically zero. Cool. We're like pretty much out of fucking ammo. I have like two pips of health. A punch takes one. Oh, that's GG. No. Yeah, I'm out of health officially. And ammo. Um, yeah, I know I have to go down there. I would like to heal. I don't know where that is. Okay, there's health in there. That's annoying. We should be able to get around this guy, though. Get in there, heal up. It's interesting. Do you know what I mean? Um, I like it. But I like it because it's weird. And if I had already played a game like this, I would not like this. If that makes sense. Like, I like this because it's new, it's weird, it's interesting. But, you know... Do it twice and suddenly I'm like, alright. Losing me. Oh, yes, please. C. Yeah, we're learning the alphabet. Like playing Final Fantasy X. Learning the, uh, the alphabet and that. Oh my god. The man is gone. I will say, I mean, there's certainly something oppressive about this world. Um, not, not a lot of horror for my liking. You know what I mean? I do with more horror. Okay, fuck you. Don't step on the bones. Or the hounds will come rattle your shit. Oh, okay, hang on. It's trying to load the world. That's hilarious, bro. Um, okay, that seemed a little... Okay, this guy seems like... A right bastard. So what you're saying is... We, we're basically playing a tech demo. Oh, it's okay. See how she ends up. Yeah, I feel like we die if we go that way. It also doesn't really... Oh, there's the meat pit. It, like, the combat in it is also interesting, and I don't mind it, but there's not a lot going on. Like, you know what I mean? Like, if the, all they have to do is have, like, like, another enemy type, and, like, I have to change between two types of, like, damage or something. I mean, this seems like another enemy here, like the fast one. Um, but. Oh. I think that was the first time we've seen a door open.
find this game graphically unappealing? Unreal 4, baby. <laughs> um, I don't know. I, I like the... Uh, I don't like any of this. I like this. I like the stonework. I like... Like the grand scale of things. I think it looks pretty nice, but... I mean, caves in any game are hard to do well. Normally your caves just end up looking pretty boring, right? Because there's not a whole lot you can... Sorry. Right. While he's going on the other guy there. Duke around. Yeah, I wondered if you were going to get up. It's weird. Sometimes you just can't attack either. The enemy's too close to a wall or something. The game freaks out. Yeah, I don't imagine there's anything behind this guy. Oh, okay. There's health. Uh, I think I just shot him into another dimension. Like, we just fucking proton backed, packed his ass. Can I crawl through here? Can I jump and crawl? Uh, I'm not gonna say that didn't seem right, but... Whatever. I need the heal. Have we already been here? I feel like I should probably go back. Just looks like brown? Yeah. That didn't seem right, did it? This? Or am I crazy? Let's see what happens if we go this way. I wonder if we can jump up through. I remember fall damage in this game is an instant kill, sort of. Except when you have to fall to progress. So, there is that. Keep in mind, sometimes the game doesn't know what you're supposed to be doing. It's a weird looking thing too, eh? Kind of fun. I like weird alien shit in games, as you guys know. Yeah, it looks like we're not really supposed to be uh, interacting with this the way we are. Uh, so it's okay. Well, maybe it's not. Curious as to how this ends. Uh, and now I'm confused, of course, because I'm going backwards. Oh, hang on. This will tell us where to go. Which way? Onward. Ooh. X. M. Can you electrocute these? Uh, kinda. You, like, stun them. That's kinda neat. Uh, there's a fire... Oh, no, fire burns, and the guy died. Okay, so don't get yourself on fire. Was that again? Is that a heal? Yeah. I'm kind of full on health, actually. Oh, cutscene of sort. Uh, bodies sliding down poorly? Oh, why do the frames keep? Because the game's not optimized well. And um, it's it loads stuff like weird. Can I have these? Oh my god! Oh, I I literally swap out what's on my arm, eh? I'll take one though. Yes. Now we're talking, boys. Huh. Probably not supposed to go up here, I would imagine. However... Oh, it's, in it's instant death. Timeline, 2017 released, May 18th patch on May 23rd, FOV slider added June 18th, second patch June 21st. Okay, June 28th, able to change keybinds, June 30th, and no more updates. So the game's finished, uh, is what Borrowed's saying. 
Now, I know he might not have used that many words. Uh, but, uh, that's a fact. Did the plant just scream? Wow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's up? Y'all gonna get electrocuted a little bit? Okay, so flamethrower ammo has a different machine. That's interesting. Uh, I mean, it makes sense. Fuck all y'all. Oh my god. Like a bomb or something? Nice. Yep. Love how that teleported him back a little. It's fine. A dragon ball fight. Oh yeah. Feeling it. What do you got for me? I had a blue juice, but all the vending machines only have orange. Yeah. Welcome to the Circus of Values. That's a P. Uh, you fuck off. Dick. I think it's dead? Okay. Oh, I don't know why I thought this was a wall. Oh, it is. It's a wall over here. Okay. Okay, so let's drop in their bombs. Stuck up on blue goo. Things are happening. Uh, fire, bad. Yeah. I mean, he uses a lot less ammo just to zap him and run. Okay, okay, Billy boy. Stop that now. Star Trek TNG, yeah. Oh. I haven't watched all of Star Trek, but I've watched like every season of Star Trek. Or like, sorry, every series. I've seen them all.
Oh, that's a lie, actually. I, I haven't watched Picard or um, Discovery. And now that I think about it. Nor would I want to, mind you. Okay, so he's going to open both of these, and it's going to get real ugly. Or is it? Just burn those. We're out of fire. Oh yeah, it does take your health if you're out. That's cool. Okay. Well, you're hella out. Opening this is gonna open all of them. Where is it though? Where's the uh, trigger here? We should go fill up on ammo. It looks like we're gonna need to do some shooting. There are 40 to 50 letter slates in the game, only 26 letters. Nice. Now. Oh, yeah, that is always jokes. Well, here's, here's the big question. The big burning boy question. Yeah, that goes to that. Yeah, which goes in here. Yeah, I'm following you. But then you go to... Oh, there he is. Oh, everything behind me is open. But we're never coming back. Those, uh, those larger ones do not like smacked. But the weird thing too is, oh, the, the letter slates don't update your game. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I need more dragon fuel. Like, normally you would assume, like, now when I look at text, like, I know what the letters mean, but I don't. Like, we look at text and, like, it doesn't auto-translate. So, like, you as the player are just supposed to write all this down or something. Which, uh, yeah, good luck. There's an achievement for each letter found? Oh. It's funky. Turn something on. Oh, it's a bridge. Pretty cool. The achievement icons have a symbol on them as well as the letter. That is actually pretty cool. I like that. Okay, I thought that killed me and I was about to get actually mad. Alright, we got some story. This bothers us. For some reason. Into the surgical sarcophagi? Sarcophagus, sorry. I, I guess there are two of them. Our character's really freaking out now. I can, I can barely move. Is anything happening? Like, are the machines going, or are they just whipping? Uh, no, he's doing something to it. What? 
Remember when you got uh, drunk on uh, Jumbo Juice? And you, you prayed to Cthulhu? Everything is better. Actually, that's more like Hoster. <laughs> you use lit unironically? Something wrong with you. But, uh, yeah, take it. Uh, okay. Take it easy, wolf. Why do I feel like that's what the first level was called? I don't know. Maybe it wasn't. Oh, maybe that just is loading. Bloody bastard of a word. Sorry? You're telling me I jumped down the here and the entire world palette changed? Not that I mind, but... Well, I hate to say it, folks. I feel like we've seen the whole game. Not really sure they're uh, doing a whole lot more. Thank God, though. Dragon ammo, yes, please. Oh, that's the stuff. Can you chew through this shit. Some saturation, yeah. Oh, they're immune to bullshit. Good to know. Was that was this like a jump scare? Is that what just happened? And these guys know kung fu. What are you fucking around? Oh, we're actually fighting one. Oh, he's got a gun! Like he had like a fucking like pistol or something. Okay. Man, like... Stuff uses so much freaking ammo for that. Way easier than just shock and run. Oh, give me it. Oh, yeah. Oh, another letter. Yeah, we... Okay, yeah, yeah, cool. Okay, so we've learned about plants. Plants crack walls and hurt you. Um, shoot spikes at things and they fall and explode. Shoot spikes at Shit monsters and bugs come out. There are flamethrower turrets and they hurt you. And there's nuts and rocks. Use flamethrowers on trees. Don't walk through trees. Okay. If you cut yourself, shoot with gun. Sure. Seems about right. Out of 
to basically out of health. Give me your ammo. I think I ran faster than my fire there for a second and got a little sketchy. Sorry guys, I was hoping this would be like a fun little spooky game, but oh. Uh, I do have plenty of other stuff on the list though. Don't worry. Yeah, see I've played video games before so I know what mechanics are, but... Oh fuck, we're running out of... Don't step on the bones. Like I've said though, I do always worry, like I'm gonna... We're on a horror game, we're gonna get something extremely graphic. The devs drop this game like it bit them. See, that's why I, I always love this bar because, like, we get a story. You know? Like, we're not just playing a game where, uh. We're, like, doing archaeology, you know what I mean? We're uncovering some god awful shit that was meant to be left buried somewhere. A lot of my, uh, my favorite bad movies just have, like, a great story that- Whoa! Am I making them grow tentacles by shooting them with this? Is that what's happening? What, what the fuck? They already have those. Have they become trees now? What the fuck? Oh, what? Is that from killing them with this? That's pretty cool. Oh, when they'll receive their physical rewards for higher backer tiers? Yikes. Maybe next century, kids. That's sad, though. Because, you know, there's, there's probably a bunch of people that are super excited for this. Because, like, if you had to show me a bunch of, like, concept art, I would have been like, yeah, this is somebody's style. We've already seen this uh, picture, actually. Oh, yeah. That's, that's fucked. What did it say about dragon turrets again? It says, uh, shoot their nuts. Oh, I don't see any. This means like these fucking nuts. Very cool, they're like snakes. Right, bye. Oh, it's getting spicy in here. some health we got some ammo we like it this is like scorn 
Uh, I've never heard of Scorn. Oh no, that's not true. Sorry, I've heard of Scorn, but it doesn't pull a picture of anything to me. So does this make them grow a... Uh... Oh my god, I headshot a guy. Well, that's cool. Why is that a mechanic now? I mean, I'm fine with it, but... I guess because we got the headshot gun. <laughs> I still love those heads, though. They're a lot of fun. Guys, ready for this to be the end? And we'll go on a wiki somewhere, and we'll we'll read what every uh, everything means in it. Deep lore. Okay, fuck off. I mean, this looks cool, right? Like, what's this? What's going on there? Is that supposed to be a boss fight? Okay. Yes. I remember Scorn. Scorn is like a new game, right? Or newer. Did Scorn ever come out? Because I, I was interested in it for the same reasons. It's fine. Up to a new game. Okay, yeah. Scorn looks pretty cool. I mean, we could always play the other Clive Barker game too, Jericho. Flame refuel. Man, you run out of flame refuel constantly. Oh. Okay. Yep. 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 Hurting. Is this the flame ammo? Yeah, right. Yeah. Nice. Oh, this is flame ammo. Oh, it is. Scorn looked pretty cool, though. Bite. Just lit fam. Nice knowing you. This is probably the end of the game, eh? Oh, fuck! Well, I assume we, we tr want to try and go through the portal here. Yeah, yeah, no, man. Okay, we're full. Or now you just come out here to look at the vista. Eh? That is a 2D picture. Looks nice though. Doesn't explain anything about this world. Oh, hello. Oh, okay.
Eat shit, you little bastard. Okay, so there's a tome on the far side of this. That thing looks cool. Well, this is a friendly thing. There's a new gun, potentially? Would be cool. W. It's interesting that Scorn and this sort of sort of development around the same time. Stuff like that always makes you think. You know? Did Scorn see this and go, hmm. Yeah, that hasn't been done in a hot minute. Is it pure coincidence? Oh fuck, a new enemy. Like, he looks like he want to shoot his, his pack, but... Yeah, you do. Of course. Can you one-shot their heads? Oh, yeah. Damn. Load me up. The guns are kind of fun though, I like them. Like, this feels satisfying. Oh. The new, uh, the flamethrower enemy, that, that was kind of neat. I was kind of excited for a minute, but I'm sure he's out of the game. Like, we fought him once. Uh, oh. Like a big old bridge, yeah. S. I feel like I want to go down. What the fuck is this thing? I've already been here? What? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, was I not supposed to go down? That's awkward. Oh my god, yeah! This is that area- oh no. Surely it lets me glitch back up here. Yeah. Say. It wouldn't make you, like, backtrack that much in a video game. That would have been horseshit. This way forward. Nice. Really, because I swear I came from this way. Oh, maybe I didn't. Thought I did. Nope, I guess not. Up we go.
Okay, maybe I'm just supposed to go the other path here? That was, that was like a secret? Sorry, I know I should probably go to bed, but like I'm, I'm just so invested and I feel like we're right at the end. Oh my god, you just one-shot it. Feels good, yeah. So that's the way you're supposed to go, but what's down here? We saw this in a uh, one of our dream sequences. Oh! Oh my god! Nice. That's fun. Hopefully that wasn't just single use. I assume we have to go recharge it at a uh, a thing. Upgrade upgradable weapons though. This could have been fun. Assume you burn bees or Wow, well, maybe that's it. Maybe we got the one shot. Fortunate. Oh cool. Wow! Video games, what the fuck? Holy shit! There's a lot of bad guys. Final room, maybe? Oh, that was a weird fucking sound. Got the bees down there going. We will have them uh, murdering everybody. Some kind of weird stealth section. They saw bees and they murder people. Which, you know, truth be told, I'm kind of okay with. I'm fine with that. It's kind of my bread and butter. Whoa. A little spicy.
kind of weird you can't blow their heads off, but it's fine. Thankfully the AI is like blind and deaf. Case in point, the little probably guy that just walked right past me. Pretty weird little settings. Where'd the, where'd the bees go, sorry? So I am. Oh, a dog. You're getting fucking hyped this shit up. I guess I stepped on bo- Fuck. Ugh, sorry. It is getting a little too late for me. We might call it here. I feel, I feel like we don't have too much left. Um, and then, yeah, like I said, I got a, well, not a million, but I do have a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of other games to check out. So we'll finish this one just because I'm curious. I think, unfortunately, this is it, right? I feel like we've kind of, we've already seen the best the game has to offer. But, yeah, I'm curious, so we'll check it out, finish that, fire up uh, something else tomorrow. Take it easy, everyone. You all have a nice night.